what's up, guys? If you are into music reaction channels that are honest, raw, and authentic, look no further. You found your destination. It is the Taz and Philly Show. Welcome to our journey. And make sure that you subscribe below and enjoy the show. <laughs> We're a reaction channel with a podcast vibe. So we notice people out there that like podcasts. We notice people out there that like reaction channels. We want to try to merge the two together. We're real and authentic, and we want you to represent music appreciation like we do. So always make sure that you like and comment on the songs that we react to, as well as go to their YouTube channel and subscribe, and maybe even a step further and purchase one of their songs. Um, also, make sure that you always check the pinned comments that we have, and also our community tab, because we always post stuff up there. You never know. might be something that's beneficial to you. Please also check out our Discord. It's in the description links. Uh, we have a lot of great channels on there, and it's completely free to join our Discord. So thanks so much. Hey, everybody. What is good? How you doing? This is your guy, Taz with Taz and Philly, coming here to give you what you come for, reactions. Um, so... This one I just realized actually yesterday, because um, as everyone knows, the Thanksgiving was several days ago, so it's not that that far in the rearview mirror. Um, and I didn't know because I don't watch football normally. I did not know that Dolly Parton, um, an iconic, iconic human being, singer, songwriter, humanitarian, um, and everything else that you can think of on a positive note. Um, did a halftime show um, for Thanksgiving. Uh, so I thought, wow. And then I realized, oh, we've never reacted to her on here. Now, I, know, I know a lot of her songs. I don't know all of them, but I know a lot of them. So I don't even know actually what she's going to be performing here yet. I just know that I thought, well, in case nobody else saw this, because maybe like myself, maybe nobody else watches football, so you have no reason to watch the halftime show, but you might like Dolly Parton. So I thought I'd give her some respect and put her into the channel. So um, this is the full Thanksgiving halftime show. I hope they don't block it from me playing it, but I have a feeling because it's, it's um, on the NFL re um, channel. So... But hopefully you'll let me put like a copyright block on it so I can at least you can at least see and hear some of it. Fingers crossed. But anyway, we represent music appreciation on this channel um, if you're watching us for the first time. So please make sure that you um, well, this is on the NFL's channel, but I would say go to Dolly Parton's personal YouTube channel if you haven't already. And subscribe. I'll do that off camera because if I change the video now, sometimes it messes up everything. But um, she's just an amazing, amazing person. Um, she's been around in the business for years. God bless her. She's like 70, I think 77 years old, and she's still doing her thing. And that's a wondrous thing. I always say if you if there's stuff that you like to do, if you're passionate about, do it until you can't do it anymore. Um, so bless her heart so in any event this is dolly parton um it's the first time i've reacted to a halftime show uh so i don't know what she's performing if it's one song or two songs so i'll commentate more afterwards but um just again as i said in the intro just make sure that you represent music appreciation um and support these artists and stuff like that um and just be appreciative of the fact that we have music Music is soothing in so many ways. It's so necessary in everyone's life. I don't care what you tell yourself. Music at some point in your life makes your day. Um, so uh, that's, that's really much all I can say about that. So in any event, I'll commentate more afterwards because this is the first time I really don't know what to expect because I don't know what she's performing. But I'm sure it's going to be amazing because Dolly Parton is amazing. So without further ado, here we go. Uninterrupted. At halftime at AT&T Stadium, where the tradition of giving only grows stronger here on Thanksgiving Day. For 27 years, the Dallas Cowboys and the Gene and Jerry Jones family have kicked off the Salvation Army's iconic National Red Cattle Campaign. And this holiday season, 
They are joined by a very special guest. Well, happy Thanksgiving, everyone. This year, I've teamed up with the Salvation Army to love beyond the holidays. Now, when you drop a dollar in that red kettle, you can make a difference for the families who are struggling to put food on the table and for the single parent who can't make rent this month. Show your neighbors in need love beyond the holidays by finding a red kettle or giving online at SalvationArmyUSA.org. And now, the tradition continues... Here to kick off the annual Red Kettle campaign, please welcome global superstar and rock star, Dolly Parton.
wow, wow, wow. That was really, really, really cool to see and hear. Really, really entertaining. So three, I think four actually songs that <laughs> that she did. Um, she just doesn't. Um, I'm trying to think of the word. She just doesn't get old. Like she's like, and I don't mean age old. I mean like as far as entertaining and and a joy to see. Like it just it doesn't get old seeing her like she's been in the business for so many years and singer songwriter she's been in several movies even some that i've seen um and then she's just she does so much for people for charities she cares about so many different things like she's just an all around overall wonderful human being as well as singer and songwriter and 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 um actress you know she just does it all and i'm just so happy that she's still loving what she does you know she's still gracing the stage and she's still doing her thing so i mean that was a really cool halftime like i should i should make it a point to start watching like halftime shows even though i don't like football but just watch halftime shows just for that part um and it's great too because she her fan base is all different shapes size colors genres ethnicities doesn't matter where you live and that's really stellar because i i feel that that's hard to do like you know either if you have a certain niche of people that like you in general but to have like everyone like you like you know if you pan the crowd and stuff or hear people that love her like i said i love her too like you know some people may think that oh you love dolly Parton, and i was like yeah she's just really really good i mean she's just a great performer and like i said she does everything and she has such a pure heart Cause some people in this business, you know, they let it get to their head and they don't do the greatest of things with it. They just sing for the money. That's not her. She does everything, but she cares about people and she shows it and she always shows it. She's always been doing that thing. And she just happens to be super successful at everything that she does, but that's perfectly fine. Like, you know, it's well-deserved. Um, so, you know, bless her heart. Bless her heart. That was really, really nice. Let us know in the comments how, <laughs> excuse me, let us know in the comments how you felt about seeing this. Um, wonderful, wonderful performance. She still has, it still looks amazing. So has a wonderful voice. Nothing's changed. Um, and I hope she, she keeps doing it and has the best of health more and more and more years. So, um, to come love, love, loved it. Um, there's not much to say. There's not going to be any ass or pass on this because I don't think anybody should ever give Dolly Parton an ass. So this was amazing. You know, this was more of a respect and, and homage to her when I found out, oh, she did, um, you know, the halftime. So this is just to represent her. Since this channel represents music appreciation, you have to appreciate her music, her artistry, her human humanitarian ism that's a word um all around great so let us know your thoughts in the comments let us know if this is the first time you've seen that um or if you saw it already um and how to make some you know her songs some of her songs are just so iconic the nine to five made me reminisce when i was younger you know and um you know a totally different era for me and everything like that so it was a nice flashback in my head that particular song but all her other songs are just amazing as well. So, all right. In any event, this is Taz with Taz and Philly, and I want you to take it easy and keep it breezy. <laughs>